Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back. Got you one more again. I hope everybody is going blessed. I'm going blessed and highly favored, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family. Just thank you so much for the love and support, and you know, just being there and you know, dropping comments and all that, and, and just steady. You know, supporting the channel. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you are comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction and also if you feel like the videos just gave you good information or even good vibes you feel like you want to share with a loved one or friend please go ahead and do so and while you're at it go ahead and give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites as well and once again thank you so much for stopping by the channel and I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today the beautiful meditation that I'm listening to is called All Seven Chakra Healing Meditation Music Miracle Happens. And I'll go ahead and post that link in the description box below. And today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey, Oka's on a new chapter. I mean, y'all, we're closing up this year. I can't believe that 2000... I mean, I said, yeah, 2018, I had to think about it. I'm like, whoa, is it 2000? Yeah, 2018 is almost over. You know, all these new things that we're starting, we're going through all these major shifts. And it's like I've been talking to so many of y'all from emails to one-on-one -on -one to, you know, on here and even on Messenger. And it's just like we're all going through these emotional past regressions or it's just like the past vomit like I call it you know has been coming up and you know we're going through different things but we're actually going through it in a different way you know um a lot of us are starting to catch up or some people are just now starting to go through the spiritual awakening some people have just been going through it for a while and the ones that have been going through it for a while is almost over thank god Thank you, Jesus. Because <laughs> all this stuff we're going through, y'all, it's just like we're all in sync with each other. It's just like y'all been, you know, I'm sitting up here looking at all these little breakouts I've been having. It looks so nasty. And I'm just like, oh, my gosh. And having these intense dreams that it's just been losing my last mind. But I guess it's just things that I'm clearing out that, you know, it's no longer serving me. Or it's just like, like, uh like depressing bad memories or something like that that I'm just letting go of and setting free but it's just what us starting on this new chapter is such a beautiful blessing because a lot of us had things sent to us that broke us down <laughs> some people you know um sadly to say didn't make it or just lost their last mind but it's just when you are able to go through things and you see that the pain that you had to endure it served a purpose and it's just like it's sad that we had to go through crazy stuff like that but when you actually sit back and look at it like wow you know yeah I went through this this and this and this and that but look how it's you know it built me up you know things has been sitting in our life like you know it meant to break us down but it had to break us down so we can go ahead and put new pieces back together and be be that person we were always supposed to be in the first place but we couldn't get there until we had to go through something tragic either we lost loved ones um found out the truth about our families or found truth about people that we really truly cared about you know losing people and just you know losing jobs all those different things but it takes us to go through it to get to it you know, if we're growing in different ways, we're finding strength in, in things that, you know, we didn't think we were able to have that strength in. You know, there's so many people I know that, Rosalind, I want to start my own channel, or Rosalind, I want to do this. And I'm just like, you can do anything that your mind is capable of doing. And it's just a lot of us are doing things that, you know, we shock ourselves that, that we do. There's just like, you know, oh, Rosalind, I don't know how to do this. And it's crazy because it's like when people come back and tell me, Rosalind, I want to do this and this and that, but I just don't know how to do it. But you're telling me everything you did, and I'm just like, Yo, you just told me, but you were not catching it, but it's okay. 
you know, I love to be able to help out people when I can because, I mean, it makes me feel good when I'm able to help somebody because I know when I first started this, I had no help. Only help that I had was from my dad, you know, and his spirit or spirit guides or God, you know, universe, you know, everything was supplied for me towards that time. And it's just like I try to tell people, you know, when you're on that road of success or you're on that road to get something better in your life, or put something better in your life, things will come to you when they're, they're, you know, all you have to do is ask and you know you will receive so when you're constantly going through things and everything and you're starting this new chapter you see that things are starting to come towards your way you know if you're trying to start off a new job or start trying to start your own private business things you know you've been set in your life like if I want to go ahead and start my own business I work for a lot of private companies where I see the stress and the ups and the downs on what you have to go through just to have your own company the things that you need to do for your company or you know for it to keep on going so it's just like when we go through these things everything serves a purpose that we have gone through because it we when we gone through the mishaps or whatever or you you gone through hard situations with loved ones and friends when you actually come across some a situation like that again you can be able to stop it in its tracks before it can even happen so it's just like when we get frustrated like why do we got to go through this why we got to go through that but you had to go through it so you can be able to recognize things before they even happen you know it's just like stopping the train from colliding you know before it actually does so you know keep on stepping you know this is we're heading towards a new year and you're going towards a new you so you keep shining you keep thriving and doing the things that you need to do to get up there so i know you can do it and you know just keep up the patience i know sometimes it's hard i trust me i know because it's like i don't know where my life is leading me you know so many different things are coming in my life so many things are leaving my life but i'm blessed for every situation i have been in because it's taught me you know it's just before like i when i used to go through things and i was like you know I try to give people chances and chances and chances and it's just like you can't keep doing that you know you block your blessings on doing that and plus people take advantage of you but now it's just like when I go through situations I can go ahead and nip it in the bud and just go on about my life you know it's like you should never feel guilty about trying to better yourself especially if you know something is trying to hold you back so you keep doing what you need to do and I hope this was able to resonate uh, with you and you know you find some comfort in it and you know y'all be pa I'm glad y'all have been patient with me because it's like I had my granddaughter all night and even though I love her to death boy that that really wiped me out because I was just starting to get my energy back up so it's just like now I've been having to take a lot more breaks than I usually do and I that upsets me but I know it has to serve a purpose because it was just like with all the things that I had going on, doing one-on-ones on Messenger, doing one-on-ones on, you know, just for FaceTime and or um, just answering emails. It took a lot out of me because I was doing so much at one time and I needed to slow down, even though I felt blessed because I was able to help all these individuals. But I was giving so many much energy out that I have enough for myself. So now it's just like now with all the shifts and the changes that everybody's going through along with myself, you know, I have to be taking my break. So y'all, you know, as soon as everything gets settled down, I'm going to go ahead and start my live back up, going ahead and do my videos on a daily. So I'm glad that y'all are here. Thank you for all the new subscribers and for chiming in with me and I'm much love to y'all and you know send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can know that you are blessed truly favored and highly loved and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days and I'm sending out much love and light infinite abundance comforting vibes healing vibes and loving vibes especially whoever truly needs them and my post notification shot out goes to Ehab Touch. Much love to you, fam. I hope everybody's doing good in New Mexico. Much love to you. Sending blessings and love and light your way also. And many blessings on the success that you're trying to reach. So, y'all, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Like and even share on your social media favorites. Drop me a line. I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up telling me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and you toward the positive direction. And don't forget, last but least, like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video. And I will see you. Have a blessed, safe weekend. Be responsible for everything you do. 
and peace. Be wow.